Hi, this is Sai Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forexpsami.com forum weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation of the currency markets and should help you to stay on top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpsami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Welcome back everybody. So your currency keep going with the <coughs> bullish steps. So yesterday we have got the pullback from the area that we said and you remember we said that uh, the point where market was standing recently and yesterday it was as I call it culmination point. Um, this is important feature on all markets and any trading stops. This is actually the point that uh, uh, makes the border between the bullish and bearish context on the market. So this is actually the point uh, below which uh, the bullish context will be will be erased. And usually such points provides best risk reward ratio because actually when you are taking the position at the vital point, you usually do not need to place too far stop because your invalidation area, invalidation point stands very close. And that particular was the point that we discussed recently. So as a result, you can see market has bounced up. Um, it's not bad performance actually. And on the daily chart, we've got the second grubber in a row, which makes our life a bit simpler. And actually, uh, currently we could use as an validation point the loss of the grubbers. Uh, obviously, the performance of the euro is supported by the expectation in central bank meeting, where at least as market society expect, central bank should said should say something concerning closing on the quantitative easing program. And as we already provided some charts in our vehicle reports, expectation sentiment of the market concerning rate change in the European Union, these expectations are rising months to months. In recent months, currently it's already supposed that uh, probably for 10, 11 points, 10, 15 points, maybe uh, central bank should start change rate right in the July. And today we will see whether it's uh, correct expectation or not. But uh, what we could say is that mostly current situation depends not on the technical side, but on the fundamental side. Because imagine what will happen if Christine Lagarde tells nothing about um, tightening of the policy. No hints on rate change, no hints on the closing of the PEPP program, so nothing. In this case, of course, we will see downward collapse because partially or at least on the 80% probably this expectation was already priced in in the current performance. So, but let's hope that technical picture corresponds to fundamental scenario and uh, as we've got, as we're getting here as bullish grubbers, your accounts will be able to show some upper continuation here. On the shorter term charts, we still keep going with this uh, butterfly pattern. This market bounced up from this area. Um, this is the target that we discussed, 108, 108, this is untouched XOP existence, slightly higher, we have the um, butterfly target. Another confirmation on the possible bullish action comes from the Great British Pound, where we're also watching for uh, bullish patterns. Actually, if you remember two days ago, we talked about this possible retracement, but currently, as you can see with this recent performance, market has taken out of this top, it means that this ABCD pattern is not valid anymore. And this is more bullish performance than if you take a look at the from the perspective of this hand and shoulders passion. It also tells you that this is not the way how market us usually should form uh, the right arm. So this is uh, not bearish performance here as well. Which means that currently we could focus, for example, on this reverse hand shoulders that actually our second larger scale passion that we are watching for now. Um, since we have here some bullish context, the same we could get on the euro and indeed well currently as i said technical picture stands bullish and suggests that upward action could keep could happen on the lower time frame here as you could see that market turns to some pullback um, this was the first area where we intend to take the long position now uh, this is will be the second chance for taking the long position you could act as i said differently as usual so you could wait for best point for position taken which is uh, op here it's around 107 107 cluster 
uh, as you can see, there's two levels between the OP and OP actually stands very close to the 50% support of the euro currency. So for position taking, I would watch for one or seven probably, not to one or six, eight, eight, because so P stands here. And also guys, so here we have some kind of the minor OP. So if you use a point right from the starting on down reduction, you can see that perfectly agrees one or seven area. So for position taking, it would be better to focus on this level. And additionally, you could take position right here because yes, on this technical performance, it seems that market should go to the OP just because here, as you can see, some acceleration downs, faster action <coughs> than an AB leg. But currency currently really unstable. Its volatility is rising. We're coming to the central bank meeting, new traders stepping in and brings some uncertainty. So it might happen that market could finish retracement right there. So it might be this AB COP. Here's we have actually COP agreement with a major 30% support. That's why this level is also worth our attention. But this is guys is up to you. It's uh, your strategy, how you prefer to take the position. I'm just um, provide you the options that you could follow, for instance. So whether you would like to take the perfect entry, just wait for this area. If you're not confident enough with this, just split your position, take minor part here at 30%. For instance, here is market dropped at one or seven, take the rest on this level. And some kind of the ABC patch we could get. It will be cartridge cheaper to buy, so very classical. Uh, upward continuation passion. And then let's keep focus on them um, and watching for central bank meetings, see what will happen.